The brown marmorated stink bug is a serious farm and garden pest that U.S. Department of Agriculture researchers are trying to monitor and manage. It attacks various uh, vegetable, fruit, and field crops. So apples, pears, and peaches, it's definitely on, uh, especially as they're maturing, unfortunately. A lot of times that damage is hidden um, until you cut open the fruit, which is very unfortunate. It can affect soybean as well. Various vegetables, tomatoes, peppers. Weber and his Agricultural Research Service colleagues in Beltsville, Maryland, just outside of Washington, D.C., are trapping stink bugs to study their attractants or pheromones. We could use this as a management tool to monitor, to make sure we know where the pest is and how high the numbers are so we know what we might do about it, but also potentially to use it to trap it out of the crop or near houses where we don't want it to be. Fifteen years ago, the brown marmorated stink bug came here from Asia, so ARS researchers are looking there for natural predators. And they're mainly these tiny wasp egg parasitoids. They're harmless. They're, they don't sting. Their main objective in life is to find stink bug eggs and make sure that it doesn't end up a stink bug, it ends up a wasp. And just why are they called stink bugs? Weber explains. The stink of the stink bug is fairly similar to cilantro. That doesn't mean you necessarily would want to eat it. And I'm sure that's repulsive to the predators that it's trying to repel. According to the website stopbmsb.org, stink bugs have been found in 40 states and the District of Columbia. Last year, stink bugs did $52 million worth of damage to mid-Atlantic peach and apple crops. In Washington, D.C., for the U.S. Department of Agriculture, I'm Bob Ellison.